Ladies and gentlemen, you are still watching Project SOAR, series of online academic reviews on mathematics clay learning modules. Please subscribe, like, and share our official YouTube channel, MTM channel, and our official FB page, Math Team, Mathematics Teachers Association of Mandaluyong. Our great Four presenter is a teacher one, graduated at University of Rizal System, Morong Rizal. Mga batang mandunong, home learning partners, let's welcome Ma'am Sinaida Santos. Before I begin, let me greet first our OIC SDS Dr. Romela M. Cruz. Our OIC ASDS Dr. Aurelio G. Alfonso, CIDG Chief Dr. Aline G. Mendoza, SGOD Chief Ma'am Emma G. Arubio, our EPS in Mathematics Mr. Restituto I. Rodelas, sa aming mahal na principal Mr. Romeo E. Bandal, sa ating home learning partners, mga guro at mga mag-aaral, magandang umaga sa inyong lahat. Bata Manduno, Welcome sa Project Soar. Happy learning, kids! Quarter 2, Week 7. Competencies. Visualizing decimal numbers using models like blocks, grids, number lines, and money to show the relationship to fraction. Renames decimal numbers to fraction and fraction whose denominators are factors of 10 and 100 to decimals. Recap. Name the fractional parts of its illustration. Magaling! Very good! Good job! In visualizing decimal numbers, Using blocks. How many blocks do we have? Very good. How many shaded blocks do we have? Magaling. It is four tenths in fractional form. It can be also be written in decimal form as four tenths. How many tenths do we have? Very good. How many green cans do we have? Magaling. It is 80 over 100 in fractional form. It can also be written in decimal form as 80 hundreds. Using number line. By tens. Ten, ten in fractional form or one in decimal form is equals to one whole. By hundred. Sixty over one hundred in fractional form or in decimal form is equal to sixty hundreds. Using grid. How many square does this grid have? Magaling. How many squares do we have if we have 40 hundreds? Since this grid has 100 square, we shaded 40 squares. Its fractional form is 40 over 100 or 40 hundreds in decimal form. Another. How many square does this grid have? Very good. Since 
This grid has 100 square, we shaded 35 squares. Its fractional form is 35 over 100, or 35 hundredths in decimal forms. Use writing money. How do we write 124 pesos and 25 centavos? This can be written as 124 pesos and 25 centavos. How do we write 372 pesos? This can be written as 372 pesos. Remember kids, in writing money, you always put the peso sign PHP. Remember, decimal form can be represented in different ways and models like blocks, number line, grid, and amount of money. Let's begin. Direction. Color the star that represents each decimal. Number one. Five tenths. Very good. Eight tenths. Magaling. One tenths. Bravo. Direction. Shade the grid to show the following decimal numbers. 25 hundredths. Very good. 50 hundredths. Magaling. Let's do it. Write each fraction as decimals. Very good. Magaling. Magaling. Bravo. Excellent. Direction. In circle the decimal forms of each fraction inside the parentheses. 47 over 100, the correct answer is Magaling. 7 over 10, the correct answer is Bravo. 2 over, over 10, the correct answer is Magaling. 4 over 100, the correct answer is Very good. 3 over 10, the correct answer is Excellent! Keep moving. Direction. Write each amount using the peso sign. Very good! Magaling! Bravo! Write the following in numbers form using peso sign 312 and 20 centavos magaling 506 pesos excellent 